kind of caught. Hold on. 20, 30 mile an hour winds, y'all. Let's do it. But just when you thought you woke up before everybody else, here goes Lunkers with a tweet four minutes ago. Y'all, what's up and good morning. We're up early even for the early standards. Devin and I are here at the gas pump at 5 a.m. I'm gonna clear this cooler out a little bit. We got a couple bags of ice to put in here. And uh, we are taking out the hot tamale this morning, man. We're going to a legendary pond and we're actually gonna drop the boat in. There's no ramp, it could be sketchy. We'll just have to wait and see, man. Let's go ahead and get into the day. It's gonna be a lot of fun, tag along. The gas station is literally out of ice, y'all, and it's super windy today. 20 to 30 mile per hour winds from like 9 a.m. to 12. It's already starting to feel the effects. It was like 12 mph winds when I was loading the boat up. Could make for a fun day fishing, man. We are gonna see. At least we got the spot lock figured out until it wants to stop on us. Things whack, man, this Garmin unit. We're gonna try and recalibrate it, but you can't really do that in high winds, so it could be a lot of fun. Anyways, the place is out of ice. I don't know what's going on over here, but they got like five of those ready ice coolers, and they're all empty, so next station. Yo. We're getting the last couple. Holy cow, everyone's sold out. Ooh, y'all, we just got here. Good morning, check the place out. Sun is right on the horizon, man. We don't want to miss the top water bite, so instead of launching the boat right off the bat, we're actually going to toss on the GoPros and try and hit some frog fish right here from the bank real fast, then we're gonna launch the boat. Let's go. Oh, <laughs> do you see that? Oh no! Dang it! Dang it! That was all right, dude. First blow up, man. It did have it. 6:23 a.m. First blow up. Oh, fuck you! I should have waited till I felt that one. I guess I don't know. <laughs> Let me try the frog. Let me try one. Yeah, yeah, you do your thing. Let me try one. Yep. Ah! Yep, there we go. Come here, bub. <laughs> Come here. Come on. Come on, little dude. Come on, little dude. Get out of here. Come here. First frog fish for me. <laughs> and I saw the blow up. I would let him take it for a good, probably solid second, two seconds, and uh, set the hook. I'm gonna have to give him a little bit of a toss because this is pretty dang grassy and it is up in here. So. There we go. All right, y'all, before they take off, we got Armand and Isaac and Chef Bad Bass out here with us this morning. What's up, y'all? We about to kill it. We getting on it out here. It's gonna be a fun old time at the private spot. They're taking out the boat that they got on property. We brought ours. It's gonna be so windy today, man. I wanted to do some kayak fishing for y'all, but uh, it says winds in the 20 to 30 mile per hour range here in a little bit. So yeah, there's that. Throwing the battle shad to start off though. Wish us luck, man. All right, y'all, Devin on the first fish. Hat is on, winds are picking up. Let's get the keys in the boat. Everything's set up, rigged and ready, man. We are ready to rock and roll. We're gonna have a little friendly competition. See so you can't get on the biggest bass today. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Let's go. Plug it in, plug it in. Motor support. There we go. She's looking good. Tossing on the old 102. Time for the old 93. All right, let's back her up. I think I need to go a little closer. There's a big, this is gonna like just Getting this out is gonna work later, but we gonna find out. I heard that. <laughs> Chef's out there with fish already, man. All right, let's go grab Devin from the dock here and get to fishing, man. They got us beat with the lines in the water. Beautiful weather at the moment. Absolutely beautiful. Oh Turns out that storm down south ain't really messing around. It's bringing the winds with it, y'all. <laughs> Alright, 
I know, I know. You smacked it. Good one, good one, good one. See ya. It is windy, y'all, and the water's blurry, so I'm gonna throw the big old battle shot, see if I can't get a big one to commit. Out deep, far cast with the wind. Creeping on back. Oh, oh, I just got smacked right the boat. Little ridiculous. Turns out that storm down south ain't really messing around. It's bringing the winds with it, y'all. White capping out here on the pond. We're probably gonna give this just another minute and then either uh, go hit the shallows where it's less windy on that end and see if we can get bit or just uh, hop off here and hit these ponds from the banks. It's getting nuts. We're in about four foot of water. We're trying to crank and we haven't got too many bites in the last half hour. Let's see what happens though. Stick with us. All right, y'all, Chef and the gang decided to call it early on that little 17er. That thing was getting pushed around. Uh, we're over here on the Garmin Force. This thing is cranking, man, full power. We're going upstream against like 20, 30 mile an hour winds, y'all. This is not that bad. throw the rope to you over here a little ways first. Oh, fast. Oh, got it. Yeah, we just trolled on in. I threw Devin the rope just so that I could pull the motor up and we could get this in there. And now we're just uh, cranking her up and gonna try and get this thing out of here. <laughs> Four wheel drive. The tires are like right on the edge of the mud and being like in two foot of water. What happens when our trailer is still in the water pretty far you guys we got to pull the trailer up um it's not necessarily because of the trolling motor but it doesn't help that's for sure that's good now you see we can pull it and not hit the motor but we also kind of turn the blade a little bit this motor is pretty big for this boat you know what i mean about is this right here what uh, nothing let's get her out of here <laughs> all right the boat half the day is done i think we're gonna hit the banks from here on out y'all it's been a fun morning she's giving it a little juice oh yeah if it shifted to the right a little bit more that could have been bad but that's about as good as it gets pop the plug step number two get the motor support and we should be all set. Just gotta say, I always appreciate you guys' positive comments and feedback when it comes to the boat stuff since we're new at this. One of you guys told me just recently, make sure you uh, put your boat in drive. And so what happens is now, whenever you're hauling your boat, your prop won't spin freely, which apparently could cause an issue down the line. To get that tight, bring that strap around. Get around town. That ends up going right here. Boom. All right, y'all, she is loaded and ready. We're gonna clean her off and uh, go ahead and cover her for the drive back, just put her right in storage, but we're gonna catch you guys at storage. That way we can go ahead and clean her up in the shade because uh, there's no longer shade right here. So we're just gonna get back home. All right, y'all, we are back at storage. What a fun day, man. We are about to uh, spice up the hot tamale with some hot sauce right here and the condition sauce, seats, and just about everything else right here. Ultimate water spot remover and high gloss sealant. Recommended to us by my good buddy Cody Mason, man. He's also the one who took care of us with that information on a fork about not keeping those slot fish in the live well. So, major kudos, man. Really appreciate all the tips you've been giving us. And look at this. Ooh. We need to uh, clean her down. Guys, in the intro, I rolled a couple clips from what we're actually going to post tomorrow. We filmed so much today, I didn't even realize it. But the first half of the day was the boat portion. The second was actually fishing off of our tailgate. Uh, we caught a bunch and it was actually a ton of fun. We were out with Torrance. We're going to post that tomorrow. This is going to give me something to edit uh, for tomorrow because I'm going to be filming probably all day. I'm going to go out with Lunkers TV. It's going to be a fun time. That's the plan at least. I'm going to meet him at Chick-fil-A early in the morning. So uh, wish us luck, man. For tonight's video though, I want to get this up hopefully by 10 o'clock, man. It's already like 9.30 p.m.
them. So I'm just trying to crank out this edit for you guys that you just watched and do the bank slash tailgate fishing tomorrow. It's going to be a lot of fun and I think you guys are going to really enjoy it. Go ahead and subscribe if you're not. Hit the notifications bell and turn it to all notifications if you want to know anytime a new vid drops. And uh, yeah, let's just continue on with uh, what we got here. With that being said, y'all check out my buddy Cody. I'm actually going to put all his information down in the description. Go give him a follow if you so please. He's TX Fishing, man. He's doing big things, catching big fish, and he's always providing us with some awesome info. And he's taking us out on his boat many times, dude. Go check him out, y'all. We're going to get her cleaned up, and we'll catch you on tomorrow's video. Peace out. <gasps>